Welcome to Dundee in Scotland, our main fuel dispenser manufacturing site for Europe, Africa and the Middle East. You may already know Tockheim as the European leader in maintenance, service and manufacturing of petrol dispensing systems. Well here on the northeast coast of Scotland is where our main production site for fuel pumps is based. Good afternoon Tockheim, how can I help you? Our facility opened here in Dundee in 1995 and has 10,000 square metres of capacity. We can produce up to 70,000 nozzles a year with each dispenser potentially bespoke and all built to order. Last year we built and delivered dispensers to more than 90 countries worldwide. What concerns us most here is quality. Quality of our components, quality of our meter, quality of our dispenser. For many years now we have been using lean manufacturing techniques. It is fundamental to our drive to improve productivity and quality throughout the plant here. By using lean and encouraging zero defects, we have improved productivity by 50%. There are three core processes at the factory. Dispenser assembly, meter assembly and testing. The aim is for Tockheim's dispensers to be as robust and reliable as possible. These machines are going to dispense fuel in all types of weather conditions for many years. Our manufacturing philosophy is to design to challenging engineering standards, build using the highest quality components and use lean manufacturing processes throughout the factory. In order to make such a wide variety of different dispensers, we need lots of flexibility in the way we organise our production. We divide production into cells which control quality and workflow. So what you see here is our version of mass production, but with a large degree of customization. Each day on the 510 line, the mix of product being built depends entirely upon the orders that customers have placed. For example, this pump is going to Russia, this one is going to Germany, and further up the line there are pumps going to France. We start by building the sub-assemblies off the production line because each may be different. They then get fed, just in time, into the assembly line and are matched with specific dispensers. The dispenser assembly lines are divided into production cells adding a different part of the build, for example hydraulics, wiring, pre-test cladding and finishing. Each has 10 to 15 experienced operators. The dispenser gets built as it moves through successive cells with each team performing a quality control against the checklist before accepting the dispenser. The quality walls keep our standards high. The meter is effectively the heart of the dispenser and must accurately measure the quantity of fuel delivered to the end user. Our latest generation meter, the TQM, is designed and produced to such a high standard it delivers negligible drift over time. The TQM piston system has proven in 12 million litre tests to be at least as accurate as a spindle meter and has passed extended life and field testing with flying colours. The meter is built offline initially as a series of sub-assemblies which are fed into the final assembly conveyor. Each meter operator is trained in all parts of the job and operates flexibly, working to the requirements of the line. The meters are tested and calibrated on a fully automated test machine which issues a unique serial number and records the test data for each meter in a database for future reference. We have been using lean visual techniques for many years now and we're getting pretty good at it. This, for example, is a cell board where we encourage the operators to post their good ideas. This inclusive bottom-up approach has led to significant quality improvement. Each manufacturing cell has a quality board near the production line. Teams record quality data and suggest improvements daily. The purpose is to involve everybody in continuous improvement. Our current system has a lot of people independently doing actions. In this new system, we want people to talk, share, 
So what goes through... We frequently hold a Kaizen event to bring together cell operators and support staff. A Kaizen session identifies ideas to improve performance and these are quickly implemented. This empowers and motivates staff to think for themselves and aligns the engineering and production teams to work better together. Kaizen is only about improvement. It's simple, it's us working together as a team using some tools and techniques to improve our business. Quality control is the responsibility of every operator in every cell. We have checks at Goods and Works, quality walls between each cell and each dispenser is checked 100% for every function on these test bays behind me. All in all, 12 points where quality is checked on every single dispenser. The quality of parts into the factory is controlled through a stringent system of approvals. Parts pass through a state-of-the-art, numerically controlled machine, or CMM, which monitors key dimensions. Before leaving the factory, dispensers pass through one of our 10 test bays. Here, each dispenser is 100% tested for all electronic, hydraulic and mechanical functions, checking customised choices as well as country-specific safety and weights and measures regulations. Finally, each dispenser is then submitted to a final audit station which automatically delivers a series of parameters for the operative to check against. All data is electronically recorded against the serial number of the dispenser for traceability. The plant has its own in-house facility for painting pre-proof panels and preparing them for assembly. We can screen print complex designs or more commonly, we use our state-of-the-art printing facilities which accurately reproduce customer branding and logos in line with brand guidelines. So here at Dispatch we are shipping 1,500 nozzles per week to more than 90 countries worldwide. Our performance in quality, cost and service are world class. This is testament to our absolute commitment to lean manufacturing and continuous improvement.